Dude, I was talking. I didn't even know my microphone was off. That's kind of embarrassing, man. <laughs> I was wondering. It's like, how come I can't hear myself in the headphones? But yeah, this is Dr. Greenstone. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new, please consider giving me a follow. This is going to be an ongoing thing. You can see this is day six of our Skyrim 100% vanilla run. Oh, I have this as Minecraft. <laughs> I didn't switch the... I really need to pull myself together here, man. I've loved everything about the beginning of this. <laughs> oh, man, where is it? Here we go, Elder Scrolls V. Okay, let's go. Is that, is that better? It's successfully updated. Okay. Like, <laughs> I'm almost tempted to turn this stream off and redo this entire thing, dude. That was... Like... <laughs> it's, it's not one of my streams unless I flood something, guys. But, yeah... We're back. We're going to be doing another 100% run. Uh, another day of our 100% run on Skyrim. Last time we took out about a dozen different locations in the Whiterun area. And this time I left off in front of a tomb after I killed Dragon. It's filled with ghosts and stuff. Maybe the head. Like, maybe my title is just a big clickbaity. No, I'm sorry. I'm not playing any Dead Mouse in this channel. I wish I could, guys. I, I so wish I could. Ghosts and stuff. More ghosts and stuff. Like, those are two of my favorite songs of all time. Like, there's something iconic about it, man. Dead Mouse in general is one of my favorites. Uh, 4 by 4 equals 12 is, like... That was my introduction into trance, in, uh, to electronic music in general. Although before that, I, I didn't know I was listening to Daft Punk with my dad. Like, he loved Daft Punk, but, uh, pause here. Like, none of this is working. <laughs> I can't even... Oh my god, here we go. Finally getting this game started, guys. Let's do it. Hey, thank you so much, Tommy Vods. Thank you so much for hopping on the channel, man. I just gotta check something real quick on the phone before I get started. <laughs> this is one little secret for any small streamer is that you gotta follow yourself. You gotta be watching your own channel. <laughs> that's it. That's how you get that one extra view. Oh god, and it's it's not even muted. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, I I I messed up. I didn't switch the gameplay. Uh, I didn't switch my game title. I usually play on Java when I do, but tonight I'm actually doing Skyrim. I already just updated the uh, I already updated the, uh, the, the 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 thing thing the title. But it looks like you hopped on a little bit before I managed to do it. I'm sorry about that, man. I'm not trying to clickbait. <laughs> I do do Minecraft on Mondays and Wednesdays, but Tuesdays and Thursdays are the Skyrim night. You're welcome to stay with me, you're welcome to join if you want to, but yeah, I play on Java primarily. I know it's a bit of a clickbaity title, but this is why I call it Ghosts and Stuff. That's when I left off, I got attacked by these guys, and apparently... They're being reluctant and held against their will, forced to fight me. That's not good. Fendal loves headbutting people. We ain't gonna have any mercy upon them. They dare to raise their blades against us, they're gonna die. They're gonna get the sword. And uh, let me know if my sound quality is out of whack. I had to do a few adjustments with my microphone and my... Oh. I'm already, I'm already here? Would you look at that? Yeah, I had to do a few adjustments with uh, my stream OBS the other day, so I'm not sure if I have uh, uh, good quality sound in the background here. Oops. Didn't mean to take that hex. He just attacked my man behind his back. That's rude, really dude. Sorry. See this guy, he's making excuses. He says he doesn't want to hit us, but he's hitting us. And that's all I care about. And he keeps saying it over and over again. I don't believe this guy. I'm sorry, I don't. He, he seems a little too eager. Jeez, Fendal, jeez. Oh my god, man, chill. You didn't have to do it like that, bro. Okay, let's see. Yeah, we're not falling for that. That's a pitfall trap. 
I might hop down there later. I think there's a necromancer that I have to take out. Okay, you can see that red dot? Okay. Oh, that chest is probably gonna open up. <laughs> you see the ghost? He just fell right through the trap door. Like, where did he come from? I think he just did that twice. Looks like there's a stairwell. I'm, I'm starting to remember this mission because I've played this game a lot. This isn't my first Zerodeo. So why I'm playing on legendary, uh, legendary difficulty here. It, it's really been the only way I played for years. Kind of elitist like that. Sorry about that. <laughs> I think this is yeah, this is the way. <laughs> okay. But I believe there's a necromancer down here that's enslaving all these poor guys against their will. Like I know, astute observation, right? Ghost forced to fight me. Like, whoa, must be a necromancer. But, uh, there aren't any liches in this game and vampires can't do that. Vampires uh, well they can be conjurers, but most vampires aren't conjurers. Well, a lot of vampires are conjurers actually. I'm rambling, and I'm not making no sense. And I'm flooding this lockpick. Right. And that's it? That's all there is over here? What's in this guy? What you got? Taking all the mead, taking all the booze. And 400 bottles of booze, it's no joke. Got it back at the home, and that's just the start. That's before I've even raided all the taverns in the nearby area. I'm sorry. Oh god. This is where I died. Tell me my dead I love that. I thought he was gonna catch me for a second with that power attack. Okay, let's go. What's that do? I think that's the lever I just pulled. I thought I was gonna do this thing. No, it didn't do the thing. What's it do? What'd it do? Don't do nothing. Okay. I'm gonna have to go back down then. Right, I'm just gonna pull it back just in case it did do a thing. Because maybe it did a thing and I can't see the thing. Maybe the thing is down here. Did it open the trap doors? Maybe there's a secret door down here? Yeah, man, I can only stay on for a couple of minutes. Like, I just got into Twitch while I was setting up my stream, and I saw you were on Minecraft, so I decided to drop by, say hi. Like your fishing hut, man. See you working on your farms. Are you going to be making more houses? And it's good to have you on even for a little bit, Shinra. Man, that's awesome. Glad you guys are having a good time. Hey, does the title still say I'm playing Minecraft on your end, or does it say I'm playing Skyrim? Had somebody come in, ask me if I was playing Java Edition. Oh, uh, just making the making the beach first? That's fine too, bro. Hold on, I'm going to uh, quick save. It's still Minecraft? Bro, I thought I changed that. I yeah. thought I'd change that. Hold on a second. I can't let that stand. When I'm picking up items, that's that's essentially a pause screen. Let me see. Oh my god, it still says I'm playing Minecraft. That is... <laughs> that's kind of embarrassing, man. That's really embarrassing. Alright, update. Successfully updated. It should say that I'm playing my, uh, bleh, Skyrim now. It does. I'm just hoping that... <laughs> <laughs> no wonder I've just been confusing the crap out of people who've been dropping in. My trap. <laughs> oh, this <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> I, I didn't think that I was going to be able to kill him. I knew I'd be able to hit him. Oh, poor puppy. That's a little bit, uh, that's kind of sad. It's still hilarious that I managed to mark him like that. But this level is so nostalgic for me, man. 
Like, when I first played uh, Skyrim, like, this is the area that I fell into by accident. And I, I died quite a bit over here because it, that dude was stronger than I was at. Like, I was a very low level and I was a noob, so I didn't know how to kill the guy. And he would just murk me over and over, and I was so bad at the lockpicking back then, I couldn't get his key. Alrighty. He's just talking about killing people and taking their souls. What a jerk. He's not getting my soul. Oh wow, and he even had many. Yeah, that's a stone of Baron Zaya. We're up to four. Ooh, the crown of Baron Zaya is going to be a thing coming soon, guys. I can feel it. And our next level is going into stamina because I need more carry weight. Let's see pickpocketing. I need deep pockets. Let's go. Do we have pickpocketing? Pickpocketing, please, please, please. I feel like I scrolled past it like twice. Here we go. Hmm. No. Extra pockets to level 50. I'm gonna have to work on my pickpocketing at some point. But I made a thing where I can't quick save when I pickpocket. I'm trying to do as few amount of exploits as possible. Which reminds me. That was the fourth tag that I was thinking of. Let's get that single player. Let's get that out of here. It's Skyrim. Dud. Single player. Let's go. No exploits. I guess there's no major glitches. Update. And I forgot to walk <laughs> out of that. Oh, dude. <laughs> I kind of rushed it. I gotta stop rushing these streams, man. <laughs> That's a really bad habit. I feel like I'm so unpresentable right now. Like a chicken with his head cut off. It's like, ah, 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 ah! That's not good, bro. That's not good at all. <laughs> I should have everything set up right away when I get here. That's besides the point. I need to get some things to fend on. I got your back. <sighs> Gotta love the care. inventory management, bro. And he's already got all my dragon bones. Oh boy, let's see if I can give him anything. Let's see, let's see. Oh, he likes that shield. Well, you can have that shield. Well, actually, no, you can't. That's my shield. <laughs> give me that shield back. Where's that shield? <laughs> You already have my nice steel shield. You can't have my dwarven shield, too. Give me that. But then again, like, I'm, I'm kind of dual wielding, but I need to work on my block. Oh, decisions, decisions, decisions. Let's get that. I so hope it doesn't equip that axe. It's kind of it's 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 shitty. If it's more valuable than his other one. Okay, he's fine. He's still using the album one. Already been here. Let's go. And if you're just joining me, thank you so much for hopping on with me. Um. Oh, who am I kidding? I'm usually this disheveled. I'm, I'm, I'm usually this out of sorts when I first begin my stream, so I'm sorry about that. I don't mean to be... I always come in here planning to have everything together and everything ready to go. Like, I put some thought into what my title is going to be, what my tags are going to be, like, and uh, what I'm going to be doing that night. So why we're, we're dealing with ghosts. But it looks like <laughs> the best played land... Uh, the best played lands... <laughs> the best laid plans will crumble in the face of the enemy. And that's just the reality of life that I gotta deal with, you know what I mean? But I still feel bad that I just did not have my shit together when I got here today. It's like 13 minutes in, and I finally have the correct tags and the right title on my game. And this is a bit anticlimactic. Like, the whole title is about the ghosts that I was gonna kill, but now I'm already done with the ghosts. And now it's time to head back to White Run to unload all of our fat loot. I promise this won't take too much time. I gotta get rid of the bones. Uh, we do not have a house in White Run. I'm actually putting all of my uh, loot into a chest in uh, my my uh, house in Falkreath, where it's Lakeview, Rock and Lakeview. And I might be adding a little bit more to the house today. I have got to get the blacksmith's area done. I think I'm going to be doing most of my blacksmithing at my house if I can help it because that's just where I've been storing all my ingots and leather. It might be better if I just grab all my ingots and leather when I'm ready to do blacksmithing and travel to, like White Run or Riften or something. But I want to have that whole blacksmith area done just so I have an area to like show off all my cool artifacts because this is 100% run. I'm going to be grabbing 
all of the Daedric artifacts. I'm going to be grabbing all the unique items in the game. And I'm going to want a cool place to display them. And this is what we did in the last stream, guys, for those who want to know. Okay. And we got to speak to you, sold it. Oh, yeah, that's right. In the last stream, we caught you, sold it doing some shady stuff. Apparently, Isolde is a drug dealer, and she pushed it sleeping tree set. She hired some bandits to collect it for her, and they were trying to muscle her in on the price, and now we get to confront her. And we might get her to cut us a part of the deal. So, let's see what she's got to say for herself. Alright, Isolde, it's time to talk. Once I made enough money trading with the Khajiit caravans, I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Holda. Oh, okay. Did you? Using drug so money. I didn't make it past those giants then. More's the pity. If you found any of the sap, I'd be willing to pay you the same cut I offered him. Better price than you're likely to find otherwise. Probably. That's all she has to say about it. I just caught you, like, I I I just caught you starting up a drug circle, and that's all you got to say for yourself, Zelda. Okay, I have to, no, I don't want to sell it. I'm gonna keep it. That's booze. Farewell. Sleeping tree sap is a special kind of booze. So we're gonna collect that too, along with the skooma. Do you get to the cloud district very often? Life's hard at all. That bard Mikael is begging for a dagger up against his throat the way he goes on about me. I heard oh, him can I take Mikael and Legendary? Saying he'll conquer me as a Mikael. true lord conquers That's any harsh Mikael. beast. <laughs> What if I talk to Mikhail? Right I'm gonna talk to Mikhail with my face. But I don't know if this is gonna go too well. I'm, I'm a bit of a delicate guy. <laughs> I, I, I am a soft little flower. So I'm gonna need some drugs myself. And my drug of choice is vegetable soup. When you eat, go vegetarian. But where's my food? Oh, that's ingredients. Okay. Vegetable soup. This is going to up my natural uh, health regeneration and my stamina regeneration, so I'll be able to spam elsewhere. power attacks. Once we... Carlotta put you up to this, didn't she? No, we're not talking about. Sorry, I don't have to take that from you. I think I could take you. Come on. Let's this see was a mistake. Get or oh my God, he's got so much durability. Let's go. Let's go, Pansy. If Shenanigannon can take it with Gerd, I can take the Bard. Let's go. Let's go. Come here. Come here. Float like a butterfly. Sting like also a butterfly. I think that's how that goes. Why one of them? That's a good question. He hits pretty hard. Ah, he's cornering me. Ah, I r really love it if this guy accidentally hit one of the guys in here and he gets killed. I mean, that would be dealing with him, right? If I could trick this guy into hitting somebody else and then he gets taken out by the town guards, wouldn't that be taken? That would be taking care of him, right? I don't think Carlotta cares as long as he pisses off. That's unwanted attention that you get with my friend. Break his pretty boy nose. Screw this guy. Part where I end your singing career. And I run away. I need to heal. Fendal, get him! Stand there no, I'm kidding, Fendal. Not standing, I'm running. Th this isn't retreat. Th these are tactics. Oh, who is saying that? <laughs> this is this is not cowardice. This is tactics. Alright, here we go. Oh, I almost hit <laughs> Oh, if I hit the bar owner, that'd be it. I didn't say before I got into a fight with this guy. That's a bad move. Because if I accidentally hit anybody in here, like, I'm just gonna get destroyed. 
And I've turned most autosaves off for this game, except the occasional, like, item screen autosave. Just so I have some kind of backup in case I fail. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna beat this guy. But it's the ever looming possibility that Uthir is gonna walk in front of us or something. The last time I fought him, at the beginning of this playthrough, I have tried this before. I was really good. Like, Uther kept walking in between us, and then I accidentally hit her at one point, and I had to redo everything. Like, I spawned back in at the old dungeon that I had cleared, like, halfway through. It was brutal, man. Oh, see, there she goes. That fight hungry whore, she's thinking it's like, how come I get how come I don't do this? You fight hard, you don't fight me? I'm just a poor girl. And of course the only channel that Stream Elements is plugging right now is the mustard fetish channel that my girlfriend set up. It's not my Discord. It's not my Facebook page. It's my girlfriend's honey mustard shit posting page. That's not weird at all. I think I'm actually going to adjust that. Don't let him get away with this. Dude, you see what I'm saying? These people just keep mind... Like, they won't mind their own business. Damn turkey necks. No, they're rubber necks. I think that's like a Japanese expression. People who won't mind their own business. You know how to throw a punch, I'll give you that. Yeah, I threw like a hundred of them. You win. On my honor, Carlotta won't have to worry about me ever again. You're damn right. Piss off. And give me just one second. I'm going to be messing with stream elements. How come that just logged me off? It just plain old logged me off when... <laughs> oh my god, I'm sorry about that, guys. Hold on. Stream elements, we're going to work on a few things. Because it's been fun pushing the honey mustard page, and I might do it again in the future, but uh, right now it's getting a little bit repetitive. And it's weird because she her the name of her honey mustard page is literally mustard fetish, and people are getting the wrong ideas. So I'm just uh, going to uh, del delete this one. No more shit posting about honey mustard. We might shit post about honey mustard later. But <laughs> it's been getting so weird lately. <laughs> I don't want any more of that on the channel. And I clicked this prematurely before I brought up OBS. Oh, I don't want to change password. Come on, come on, come on. I need to get my poop in a pile. That's my problem, is that my poop... Like, it's everywhere. It's like explosive diarrhea. It's on the walls, it's on the floor, it's on the ceiling. I don't know how it got on the yeah, ceiling. It's a lady but it's not in a pile. I need elsewhere. to get my poop in a pile. Get it together. Throw it in the backpack. As long as it's together. Give me the booze. We're stealing all the booze. Let's see here. I'm gonna take the gold too because I'm I'm a greedy bitch. I I got nothing else to say to that. I'm, I'm just a greedy bitch. Let's go. And we're going to ooh, make this disappear. Ah, you can't see me. Ha! Ah, who the hell is this guy sitting there? He's a mercenary. The security in white one is terrible. Shameful is what. The guards in Just city local are drums. Lazy Can't even talk though. Things need to change. No, that's right. Uh, these these nods. I'm gonna just quick save. Like no matter how many times I steal all the wine in this place, like the wine keeps coming back. It looks like I didn't think that this would happen, but apparently it is. Like all the wine in these taverns is, is getting continuously restocked, not just in the inventories here, but on the shelves. Which is making my challenge just that much more difficult. Because there's no end point to this. The end point is going to be purely subjective if based on how I you, feel. How about shopping as soon as I, like, I guess I'm just going to have to, like, look. And, and make sure that I've got 100% of the game done before I go back and check on, uh, like, my progress. Because <laughs> at this point, oh my god. I feel like I'm beholden. Like, I, I need else? to steal all the booze whenever I see it. Get off okay, of the mead. Get, get off of the mead. Thank you. Anything else? Okay, I got the booze. 
this have to just set that down right here. Thank you. And it looks like she also restocks. Okay, over here. And my carry weight's ex <laughs> I've exceeded my carry weight capacity. So I think that's my cue to get out of here. So I can just hop. I've got as your best I can. What do you want me to carry? Uh, that's a good question. I don't know. What do I have? What can I unload on you that you can carry, sir? Dwarven shield? No, 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 no. Light armor? Yeah, sure, right there. Okay. You lead, I'll follow. Damn right you're following. <laughs> okay, let's go. Oh. Hey, Sour Patch, what up, man? Oh, boy. Well, what does this guy want? I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstone. Oh. The owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travel. I haven't done this mission in a long it. time. Got to go. You know what? I think that's going to be the next one on the list. I already cleared out the temple with the ghosts. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Appreciate that's you, man. Take a look. Dude, I totally flubbed the beginning of the stream. Like, I, I forgot to change the... Uh, oh, I had this the entire time. That's silly. <laughs> I forgot to change uh, the uh, title from Minecraft to uh, Skyrim. So the first kid who hopped on is like, Hey, do you play Java or do you play Bedrock? <laughs> and then I got the tags wrong and all sorts of things, dude. It's like, I thought I was going to give myself plenty of time, but then I had to rush something at the last minute and I totally got everything. I totally wound up half-assing everything again. Don't forget to check by accident. The shop if you need anything. I'm right behind you. But yeah, man, how's Panana Gan doing? What do you want me to carry? <laughs> Wouldn't hurt. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. I don't know. Like, I don't feel like I need to do, like, a, a, a pre-stream check or something. I just need to, like... Yeah, you know. <laughs> you lead, I'll follow. I don't awesome, play dude. blades, helmets, pretty much anything to suit your. But he's having a good time, man. He he looks like he's really getting the hang of it. Like it was hard keeping my mouth shut about the oil. I was about to say something, but I was like, uh, like I'll he's probably going to use the oil more often if I just let him figure it out on his own, you know. It's really hard not to backseat gaming. <laughs> like I don't, I don't know how you manage to restrain yourself in so many different things, man. I work with my mother. It's really hard not to backseat game for this. Yeah, one step at a time. Yeah, dude. Like I was saying, it's like, why you no know disenchant? That'd be good experience, bro. You get levels. But I didn't want to say that. And it's like, you know what? It's his game. He's going to learn the hard way later. Father like, that's going to be a lesson. It's like when he finally figures out how those, how valuable those enchantments are, he's going to kick himself for it, and he's going to start disenchanting everything. At least that's what I think is going to happen. That's what I hope is going to happen. Second buy it. Oh, I should give these to Fendal. We're going to disenchant that. Uh, I'm wearing these at the moment, otherwise I would do that too. And I think we're good. I think we're good. Yeah. I'm like all, all the min maxing little the, the all the min maxing little stuff. But then again, like the min maxing I'm like the sooner you get into that, the sooner the game becomes about numbers, and that's just not fun, bro. Are you feeling sick? Like, I, I had to tell him about the blizzard resistance eventually. I think you'll appreciate this. <laughs> like, I, I, I couldn't stand the seam. Keep using frostbite on those Draugr, dude. It was killing me inside. But other than that, I'm just gonna let him... I'm, I'm, I'm just sitting back, letting him figure it out. Let's see, that... I uh, don't need it, but uh, he doesn't have enough money. Let's see... Can I buy another book? I need heal others, so let's get heal other. Healing hands, that's good enough. Lesser ward, I never use wards. I'm never going to remember to use wards. I don't want them. But lightning bolt, maybe. Maybe I'd like lightning bolt, but I think I'd really like fire bolt more. I just prefer it. 
yeah. But I, I can't help it, dude. <laughs> like, I do that too. I'm so guilty of that armor gap. I'm so guilty of buffing up the armor. <laughs> I, I've uh, got to get Dwar I've got to get Dwemer Insight. Well, Ancient Insight, I think it's called. Where, it, like, you get that 25% buff to your blacksmithing when you're wearing uh, all Dwarven armor. Like, and uh, I think there are a few other buffs that you can get to your blacksmithing. Like, uh, I think there's a specific Dwarven helmet that you can find in Solstheim that also gives you, uh, like, another 10% blacksmithing. And uh, then I like uh, getting all of my fortified blacksmithing potions up to, like... Yeah, I can't find the notch pickaxe. I've been looking for that in my Destruction Mage uh, quest, like, my Destruction Mage playthrough, but, like, for the life of me, I haven't been able to find it. I feel like a dumbass. I bet, like, I'm gonna find it in this playthrough, and I'm gonna smack myself. Yeah! I know it's on the top of a mountain peak. And I, I've, I've looked at every mountain peak on Solstheim. I've 100% at Solstheim, and I've gotten all eight black books. But I haven't been able to find the notched pickaxe. It's the one thing I don't have. Let's see. Hi, Hoth. Fuck. Okay, letting that breath out. <laughs> you know? I felt like that was necessary. That had to be done. Oh my god. I feel like I feel kind of retarded. You've got the aptitude. You should join the I just feel stupid. I don't feel mad at all, but I feel I feel like a dumbass. Like god damn it, how'd I forget that? I totally got to mix it up with Solstheim. I thought that that was like a little add-on that they put in the DLC. Fuck. Just checking for booze. You know how I got to do it. Okay, maybe I'm a little mad. Just a little bit. Like a lot of it. What the fuck? Dude, as soon as I'm done playing this playthrough, I'm going to go back on my other playthrough just to get the notched pickaxe because I'm pissed. Fuck, man. What the hell? Ah, oh, enough of the foolishness. <laughs> no, dude, it's not on this web. It's on my Xbox. This is my PC. I don't have my, uh... I don't have my Xbox account linked with my PC. These are two separate accounts. I gotta put away my ingredients and my booze real quick. No, like, now that you said it, I'm picturing it clearly. I'm picturing it clearly, 100%. I know exactly where it is. But I I need to go to High Hrothgar anyway. I only have food so far, so I think that's the next one on the bucket list. I really want to get Whirlwind Sprint. Like there have been a lot of situations where I wish I'd had that. So I <laughs> no, bro, no, don't feel bad. Don't feel bad. <laughs> I'm right behind you. What do you want me to carry? Someone someone need to awaken me. Like some someone had to let me know eventually. <laughs> I know, because, like, you have to get, uh, like, you have to go through that, uh, storm, right? You have to get clear skies. But that reminded me that I wanted to get, uh, row, and I wanted to get, uh, what's the word for foods? Like, what, what's, what's the one for whirlwind sprint? I think it's, like, da. No, 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 no. It's not Fusro Da. It's, uh, I'm thinking of the one for Whirlwind, Whirlwind Sprint. What's that one called? Wold! Of course, dude! Why do I have the Woodsman's Friend in here? That should be in a different chest. I'm gonna put that with the Daedric Artifacts for now because I just don't have a better place for it. Ah, you know what? I'm gonna keep that. I'm gonna make an invisibility potion a little later. Let's see here. Where'd I put the strong box? Like, all you can hear is the fan in the background. It's eerily quiet. Do you think I should start... Like... Fik Losa? Yeah, that's one of the ones that the Greybeards use, right? I forgot what that one does. But I remember hearing him say it. And now I forgot what I was gonna say. 
the hell was I gonna say? I don't know, some. What was I gonna say? Ah, yeah, yeah. Dude. Now I'm kind of upset too. Like, <laughs> I, I didn't know you couldn't learn that one. I've never had all of the uh, shouts in one playthrough before. But I'm kind of upset knowing that now. <laughs> Okay, which one do I have the pelts in? Is it this one? Is it this one? One of these has the pelts in it. I'm gonna remember it pretty quick here. It's this one. Yep, this one has pelts. Background music, that's it. Do you think I should start playing background music in here? Like, uh... Or should I just let the natural Skyrim music play? Because sometimes it comes in, sometimes it's just, like, eerily silent. I think... You're one of my main viewers, so I think your your opinion is rather important on this issue. And, and don't mistake my hyper my hyperactivity for like energy. I don't have any of that. This is forced manicism. Like I'm so tired, bro. Yeah. That's what I was thinking. And it kind of disturbs the natural ambience of the game, I feel. Like, what am I doing? Yeah, okay, that's good. Okay. Just had to check. Just had to check. It still says one viewer or whatever. Like, I'm check. I, I'm, I'm, uh, no. Screw that, dude. It's Skyrim. I've been looking forward to this all day. It's one of the few things that keeps me awake. That and hanging out with you guys, man. It's a lot of fun. Ah, oh, no, man. I need to stay up this late anyway. Girlfriend's not even gonna be ready to go to bed for like another three hours. So, you know, it's like I don't get to go to bed until she does. It's one of those things. But, speaking of that, I have been talking to Pops and uh, the girlfriend, and there is gonna be a slight change to uh, my streaming schedule. Uh, I think possibly starting tomorrow. Hey, Shenanigannon! What up, man? I'm glad you're here because I was just about to talk to Sour Patch about this. Like, I'm gonna be changing my uh, streaming schedule. It's uh, it might not be this week, but next week for sure. I'm gonna be doing five to eight, five p.m. to eight p.m. Like, I know that's gonna clash even more with our schedule, <laughs> so Shenanigan. I'm sorry about that. I'll be, like, a, an hour before you instead of, like, an hour after you. But, uh, like, this is mostly so that I can just, like, get to sleep earlier. My cats wake me up at, like, 6 a.m., and that's been really messing with my sleep. Oh! Yeah, I gotta run. Oh, Fendal's not here. I gotta run. That Spriggan is gonna mess me up, dude. That's friggin' it's gonna totally ruin my day. I haven't saved in like 20 minutes. Oh, no, no. Yeah, but I'm thinking uh, I'm gonna be streaming Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday, 5 to 8. And I'm probably gonna be streaming for longer periods on Saturday, but that's a kind of schedule for now. Oh, dude, it looks. Oh, did Fendal find this friggin'? I think Fendal found this friggin'. So let's take care of this girl. Oh, I missed her. Oh, boy. She doesn't do a lot, though. I'm a Nord, so this... So I get the ice resistance. Oh! Oh! She's shield bashing me! Let's go, lady. And I'm sorry that I didn't host you as a uh, uh, shenanigan. Like, I thought, like... I was watching you on my cell phone, and I have no idea how to post on my cell phone. <laughs> it's okay, man. Bounce back, check in on us, it's totally fine. Like, this lady keeps shield bashing me and interrupting my power attacks. There we go.
game audio is a little too high. Actually, let me adjust that in the OBS real quick. Hold on a second. I'm going to just tweak the settings a little bit. Uh, let me know if my uh, own audio is a little too high, too. So let's see here. I think it's audio output capture. It's a audio input capture. I think it's desktop audio, too. Here we go. So if I lower that a little bit, that might do it. No, I... Yeah, fuck it. I'm just going to mess with the games and settings. Yeah, I'm just doing it in the game. Fuck it. <laughs> Let's see here. And isn't that how it goes? Like, when you're not doing anything, it's really quiet, but uh, when you get into combat, it's, like, almost overbearing. Audio, here we go. Let's just put that to there. Appreciate the input on the audio. Jan again was talking about that earlier in his stream. I haven't gotten the chance to check my recorded videos. Yeah, he might he might bounce in and out. I think he's just giving me the host, which I really appreciate. <clears throat> yeah, I know a few of my uh, I know a few of my uh, frequent uh, viewers are uh, streaming themselves right now, like Shinra, for example, is streaming Minecraft. You might want to drop in on on him and say hi real quick if you haven't if you haven't followed. Well, I'm sure he'd appreciate it. Oh, did Fendel take care of that Spriggan? I'm sorry that I couldn't stay in his later. Like, I was on Shenanigans uh, stream, so I didn't notice that he went live. And now I feel kind of bad. Yeah, alright, bro. I'll be right here. But for now, I gotta keep going. Looks like Fendel handled that Spriggan for me. That would have really been bad. <clears throat> I just can't handle Spriggans at this point in the game. It's like that uh, drain spell they have why, would take me down to zero in like three seconds if I stood there and took it. So you just see me pausing to drink health potions over and over. Yeah, dude. Like, I, I think a lot of my followers, like, uh, started streaming themselves uh, as I was talking to them about it, and now it's like I have to choose between them, and it's <laughs> it's a nasty feeling, dude. It's like a lot of the times that Shenanigan is playing, like, his butter is also doing his streams. And Bloodstone, you know, is like one of my original followers, so I gotta go in and I gotta watch his content too, you know? Well, it's good that all those guys are streaming, too. That'll be fun to collab later on. It's only going to be for the good of the whole community. That's how I feel about it. Plus, I love hearing those guys go on for a little bit. It really lets me get a feel for you guys more. Because, like, in text... You can kind of get an understanding for how a person is, but once you see them playing video games and how they react to things, like, that that's when you, like, start to really develop an understanding, like, of some of the people you meet on these platforms. That's a cool thing I like about seeing you guys doing your own thing. I don't know what the hell this respawned, but this guy's gotta go first. Okay. And nothing came out of this crypt here, and Fendal is nowhere to be found. Oh, it's just a skeleton. Okay. Watch it. Jesus. Dawnbreaker. Why you gotta do it like that, man? He was just a boy. What? What's going on with you? Stop right there. Dude, where are you going? You're <laughs> lucky you just kept running away. And it's like, oh, I think I left the oven on. Wait a second. I don't have an oven in this hut. I don't even have a chimney. That's one thing that I've noticed. It's my stickler medievalism. 
it's like <laughs> stick I don't know that's not a word but it's like <laughs> where are all the fireplaces in Skyrim like the main houses have fireplaces but these little huts these little shacks like there's a lot of places that are lacking them or maybe I'm tweaking maybe I'm just missing them all but like these little ancient Nordic huts that are surrounding like some of these uh, like some of these tombs and crypts like they don't even have like a fire pit how do these guys stay warm I know that all the Nords have a, like resistance to cold but like nobody's that resistant man alright so that way's the way forward so I'm gonna check and see what's up here first I always like to circle around this looks like it's gonna be oh, nope this is the way forward isn't it Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. Which way do I go? Well, maybe I'll come back out that way. Oh, I remember this area. I think I went through there. Right? <laughs> that threw me off just a little bit, too. Oh, he still sounds like a good kid. Like, a bit poindexterish, maybe. But that's good. He studies hard, man. Oops, sorry, Fendel. Oh, this is why I didn't do this one. Right. Vampires. Well, I'm back. And I have Dawnbreaker this time. So I think it's going to go a little bit differently. But well, I'm going to die right here probably if I don't eat, so... <laughs> Hold on a second, I'll eat cheese. I'm not even going to give this guy room to breathe. Fuck him. Oh, what? Oh, oh, oh! Bro! No, I was supposed to do that to you! What? <laughs> French Canadian accent. No, he's, uh, I, I think he's actually Middle Eastern. Yeah, I think that's what he told me on uh, one of my streams. And he's gotten shit for it on a couple of occasions. But uh, I think he's an immigrant family. Uh, escape some of the turmoil and the civil strife going on over there. Hold on, I can't let this vampire do me like that again, dude. Like, you, you, you saw that bullshit I was subjected to. Right? He killed Cam me. I was supposed to kill Cam him. Chug that. And uh, I don't need that. I need healing. Oh. Oh. Again. Okay. Okay. Gonna do a little bit of a preemptive potion in this time. Gonna eat the soup. Then I'm gonna have a little surprise for him. Oh, he's resisting. He resisted the perilous. The per. The, 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 he, he, he resisted the thing. The thing, man. He was supposed to go down. Oh, and he gave me sick. Oh, this son of a bitch. I'm not joining the clan, dude. Not gonna be in your harem. Oh, dude. 
I think I've tried that before. Like, I had a mod uh, that uh, changed how unarmed uh, combat functioned. And all it did was make you, like, do, like, little cartwheels and shit. <laughs> I, ho I hope the unarmed goes well for you. I'm, I'm gonna quick save after that. I don't care if I'm gonna become a vampire or not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna quick save. I don't wanna have to go through that again. But fuck that vampire guy. He got two bullshit wins out of me. One of them was totally legitimate and that was my bad. But the other two wins were bullshit. Alright. No booze around here, man. These vampires never have any booze. But, well... As long as I'm already going to become a vampire, they can't give me Sanguinary Vampires twice. Oh, I see. What's this guy going to be? Hello. No, you stay down. You stay down. Sometimes, like, this controller is just a tad unresponsive to power attacks. So, like, I'll accidentally do a slash or something. Epic finish, Dawnbreaker. Yeah, what up, Sammy Hammy? Yeah, we're on Skyrim tonight. Uh, is, is my title still saying Minecraft? Please tell me it's not saying Minecraft. Please tell me it's not saying Minecraft. I already fixed that, like, twice. Oh, uh, I'm waiting on bated breath. Okay. I was actually holding my breath there while I was waiting for a response. <laughs> like, I, I don't want to have to change that again. I've already changed it twice. I'm gonna... Okay. Okay, thank you guys. I can rest. Oh, oh, now I can rest in pieces on the cliffs. I'm gonna have to go back through the cave. Excellent, man. Alright, that makes me happy. Alright, that at least makes me happy. This bullshit cliff can go fuck itself, but the rest of it makes me happy. Oh, no. And no... <laughs> a little bit. I'm sorry. I, I have a foul fucking mouth. <laughs> this is part of the reason why I have the mature content warning on this channel. Why I can't even lie about that. It just slips out, dude. It's like my parents started admonishing me for it when I was a little kid, and I did it just to spite them. Oh yeah, the lock right. <laughs> yeah, man. My luck in Skyrim has honestly always been terrible. <laughs> Like, the loot drops aside, everything else, like, I've been attacked by dragons while getting gang beat by frost trolls. Like, I had the cultists come in while I was in Riften and kill, like, three non-essential NPCs. Is this stuff like that, over and over and over again. <laughs> but I think that's everybody's experience. And no, before you ask Sammy Hammy, I have not been able to try the sex pasta yet. I want to, though. I don't have the parsley, and I don't have the cracked red. I don't have the red pepper. I haven't watched the video yet. I don't know which uh, pasta noodles it calls for, but I don't think that that should matter too much. I was thinking probably egg noodles would do it. Or it doesn't recommend, like, a specific kind of noodle. Like, all of the time... <laughs> I don't know, these guys are vampires. That's a good question. Why do vampires have this much garlic? I love this stuff, and I hardly have a clove.
Oh. Oh, that's what you're saying. <laughs> I love garlic, man. Okay, so not that way. Okay, so that that okay. Got to find a way down there. Throw on spaghetti noodles. Got you, dude. I got a lot of that too. But it only comes calls for like half a clove, right? Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! All right, let's see here. Uh, this bitch is about to wreck me. Oh what? Ah! Is there something I can do for you? Yeah. What about it? Bro. And then she was so cold. Like, is there something I can do for you? It's like, yeah, first of all, call off your fucking minions. Like, the skeleton, like... That skeleton came in clutch for her. Did you see that? Got me with that chopping overhand. Yeah, head of garlic, it's like the whole bulb, right? Yeah, I've got one of them. Oh, bro. Like, okay. This is my serious face. It's coming back. I'm gonna have to take the long way around, I think, if I'm gonna want Fendal to come with me. I don't have enough to summon, uh... Well, yeah. D do you not? It's cheap and it goes with basically everything. Like for chili, pot roast, Spaghetti, pasta. It's like I've crunched a, I, I've uh, crushed and used garlic juice on burgers and steak. That tastes real good, man. Like while it's on the grill. Like what you do is you season it like normal, and then once you flip it before you cover the lid on the grill, you butter it, and you crush. I had you crush a clove, a clove of garlic. And uh, you kind of just smear it along with the butter on top of uh, the uh, seared side of the steak before you close the grill. <laughs> no, I don't, dude. And it's been so long since I've been to a pizza place, dude. The Rona's kept me indoors. I used to work at a pizza place, so, like I was a delivery driver for the longest time. But, like, I was taking home pockets of the but of the garlic butter, man. I wasn't taking home the red pepper. Yeah, my breath gets pretty nasty. It's rank, man. Just to answer that... Just to answer that unspoken question. And I ran out of cayenne pepper and uh, all my red pepper in general. I just haven't had, like... Every time I'm at the grocery store, I forget to get more. It's not something I really emphasize a lot in my meals, and plus I got like a gastric reflux, so I can't have as much spicy food as I used to. It's a pain in the ass, dude. I blame Sam, Sam Yang noodles. You heard me plugging those so often when I was first streaming. Well, the Sam Yang noodles, like, they, they're fucking with my intestines, bro. I can't eat them anymore. It's like, like, they. Almost like I've been dumping corrosive acid down my intestines. It's bad. I can probably hear like a bit of a watery cough occasionally. That's what that's from. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> yeah, see, there it was right there. Just had to clear my throat. For the longest time, I thought that was, like, a smoker's cough or something. I was like, oh my god, I got bronchitis! But, no, it's from eating too many, too many spicy noodles. Yep, that, that's the kind of genius I am. So, what's this button do? Ooh, okay, let's try this one first. What's in here? Nothing, okay. 
So, what's this one do? Where are my boys at? Which one's gonna free my boys? Steel armor? I don't really need that. Okay, so what's this one do? Freed some of my boys. Perfect. Woo! Shut up. Banging his shield at me. <laughs> I think he got exasperated and left. <laughs> Sorry, Sammy. <laughs> okay, this one's... Okay, that one does that, so we need to pull this one. Probably... Yeah, yep, yep, it's this one. Yep, yep, yep! Okay, we're going ahead. Been quoting Ducky for the longest time. Land before time. I'm not ashamed. Alright. Okay, nothing. Moving on. Not even booze. Like, screw the vampires. Like, skeletons don't want booze? What about the bandits? Like... They don't even, do they don't even like, get them drunk before they take them in? Like, am I misunderstanding how this vampire seduction stuff works? Okay, I got a quick save. Come on, come on, come on. Let me do the thing. System one. Okay. I guess I just have to manually exit from there. That's a thing. That's not a Skyrim thing, that's just a, my playthrough thing. I think it's glitched. No, we're not doing this again. Took the bow. Don't want the bow. Let's get rid of the bow. Let's dump that. Here we go. Yeet. And we're finally at the bottom. So I'm going to be able to take out that blooded vampire. Hello? Oh, is she in here? She's in here somewhere. Screw this bitch. Oh, no, wait. She's down there. Fuck. If I'd snuck here, I probably could have gotten her. Yeah, she's right there now. Maybe if I die again, then that's what I'm gonna do next time. And I gotta take you guys out first. Oh, 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 okay. Fendal, where you at? I'm sure you will, lady. Okay, let's see. Gonna need vigorous healing. Yep, that's the effect. Oh, 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 I hit the skeever instead of her and I didn't stagger and she got me with a kill cam arc. Dude, no. 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 Okay, I can't sneak yet. I'm just going out in stupid ways. Like. <laughs> Last time, it was from the skeleton coming in clutch for for his master, and the second time, it's because I hit a skeever instead of her? Bro. Do you really want to hurt me? Do you really want to make me cry? Okay, got it. No, missed it. Ah, uh, that could have really shortened this fight. I, w I would have loved that. But... Nope, we're gonna do this the old-fashioned way. Come here, lady. Why don't you find me? I'm gonna wait for you guys to come out first. Just gonna take the slow, take the sky. The re whole reason why I took the long way is because I thought Fendal would be following me, but no. Fendel always getting lost. Only thinking about himself. Damn it, Fondle. Fondle has been freaking useless today. 
he got a few epic kills, but those were mostly kills that he stole from me. <laughs> like, I'd already gotten him down to zero. And then he came in and got a few nice finishers. But he stole my glory, dude. No, don't want to be on the on this dais here. I, I don't feel like getting the stabs. There are a lot of stabs up there. Don't want those. Not tired. Nope, I'm not tired. I'm gonna take this in a different direction. I am not tired. I'm feeling pretty good. I can do anything. <laughs> okay. That one's done. Another one off the list. We're going north. We're going to get that stand stone. I don't think this is the lady stone. Could be? Might be. It's either the lady stone or the lover stone. Fondle, where the fuck are you? Seriously. Bundle. For God, God's sakes, I gotta watch my own back out here? And what, what's going on over here at this altar? D dang it, Fondle. Fondle! Fondle, my boy. Okay, moving on. There's that wet cough again. It's from the noodles. Fondle! Uh, never mind. I don't care. You know, he can do his own thing. Fondle's a grown man. He's, he's a big boy. But he's also the steward for my house. I'm his boss. Dude's lazy. He ain't performing on the job, man. Okay, so which one are you? The Lady Stone. I got it right the first time. What does this do? No, I don't want that. It'll help. But I still want to put more experience into melee. I kind of want to get uh, my one-handed up to 80 before I take the Lady Stone. <laughs> Well, I'm gonna fire what you said right back at you. You don't have to, like, you don't have to impact your health just to watch my stream, bro. You can go to bed at any time. Oh, I'm getting chased by the fish. Not the fish. Yeah, but it's been great having you on, dude. I really appreciate it. And here's Fondle. God damn it. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Alright. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna have a much bigger patch for you at the end of the stream. I'm gonna take care of these vampires here on Blood the Throne. Alright. Yeah, peace out, man. Have yourself a good rest. <sighs> Damn fish. Want like fast travel? Like, for real? I'm getting trolled by a fish. I don't feel good about that. Oh, but I do want to explore this ship. Love these little tidbits here. Actually, what? It's because I'm going to have to deal with slaughterfish at some point. <clears throat> oh, he's right there. Fuck you, fish. Fuck you, fish. There we go, gotcha! Alright, I think I have a water breathing potion. Yep, here it is. Only for 15, 15 seconds, really? That's all I get? That's not good. That's not good. And I picked the wrong side of the boat. Oh, this is not good. 
I'm gonna drown. Fondle, damn it! <laughs> Here we go, here we go. Alright, I think I'm gonna have to check not the inside of the cabin, but underneath here next. Ah, oh, this is what I should have saved. Oh man, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Dude, I can never tell how much like oxygen I have when I'm checking these uh, when I'm sw swimming underwater. <clears throat> like, the game doesn't really give you an indication. Like, you don't have an O2 meter. Like, your character doesn't really like make different noises. Like, your screen doesn't change colors or anything like that. There's no visible like... There, there's no visible indication that, like, you're taking damage or that you're running out of air. So, like, trying to, like, raid these underwater boats always feels so sketchy. Okay. Let's raid the tower next. Falkreath Watchtower. I think there's just bandits in here. Oh, no. Mages. Oh. I'm out of my stamina regen. Gonna have to do this the old-fashioned way. I get offended every time these guys heal themselves. Like, how dare you? I'm, I'm the protag. I, I I should be healing. Me. Not not you guys. I just took the magic one instead of the stamina. <laughs> I don't care, I don't use magic. There we go. Crisis bird. Okay. Moving on. Limited bridges, conjuration, cool, 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 cool. Chest, what's in it? Ah, I get to replace my water breathing potion. Is this this one's gonna be another 15 seconds, isn't it? I wonder if this guy was trolling that boat out there. I like whenever I find like little landmarks like this, and it doesn't have any real explanation, like no notes or anything like that. Like I always kind of wonder, it's like, what's this guy up to out here? And sometimes the items that you find, like, that they're holding, kind of gives you that indication. Draw out of water breathing. Okay, so 30 seconds. So, like, he was obviously, like, checking out this lake. At least it's obvious to me. As long as he's got that potion, right? I feel like that was purposefully placed right there in the game. That wasn't RP. That's not RNG. <laughs> and we just saw that underwater boat. So he obviously thought that there were, like, obviously, I, I'm going to stop saying that. He must have thought that there was something worth finding in that boat. That's why he had that? I don't know. He's a little far away from the lake. It's a plausible explanation for why he has it. But I'm thinking, it's like, what would a necromancer want with a boat? With a sunken boat? Like, is he, like, try troll for souls or bodies, or is there, like, some kind of particular artifact that he wanted? And here's this little puddle right here, but this can't be deep enough to need, like, a water breathing potion. So it have to be that he's going towards that lake, right? And I always gotta check and see if there's anything behind the waterfall. There's nothing behind the waterfall. Dang it, my sense of mystery, my adventure. All right, can only load a few things at this place, I think. I don't think I have enough quests to become Yarl. <coughs> Maybe? I helped out Cindy. But he's not exactly, like, a resident of this area. So 
So I think the next quest I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to take care of uh, the, uh, what's this guy? The bearded dude. His problem. He wants me to kill his family vampire. So I think that's exactly what I'm going to do. Uh, okay, come unlock your store. We need to sell stuff and, and steal your booze. I'm still stealing his booze. Come on, bro. There we go. You find my brother Solov and I are the only true lords. Well met. Trinkets, odds and ends. I'm gonna steal your booze. So at first, buy my shit. This one, absorb, absorb stamina. Okay, that's way better. I'm not really interested in keeping the staffs this time. It'd be neat to have one staff of each, but I could just make those. So it might be something I do as an endgame thing, but uh, I'm not going to get too hung up on having all of the... Uh, I'm, I'm not going to get too hung up on collecting all the stats. There's not really an achievement for that or anything. Weapons, I already went through that. Steal anything Fondle, my got some for you. What do you want me to carry? I want you to carry... let's see... Take these scaled bracers of major archery. Lead, I'll follow. Why aren't you wearing those? Still here. What do you want me to carry? I, I want you to wear the, 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 the gauntlets. Okay, give me these. Okay, you're wearing the gauntlets of the old gods, so that's something. But those... those are better. So give me these. I'm gonna take this back. Yeah, he doesn't need those. He's not getting boots. I'm gonna take all the old god stuff back. And I'm gonna need that, and uh, he, he never uses his orcish bow. Why he no use? But those, uh, those are keepsakes. I'm gonna keep the shivs. I'm gonna put them up on my wall. The, the, the shivs, the, the, they, make me, they make me smile. Take a little steady steady. What have you got for sale so that I can free up some of your inventory space so I can get more coins from you? I need these. Uh, let's get cured, cure disease because I don't want to become a vampire. I almost forgot about that. Uh, bound sword. No, we don't need that. Bear pelt. We don't need that either. Let's Maybe the grand soul gem. If it were filled, I'd probably jump on it, but uh, it's not, so let's, let's just pass it up. All right, then i got to get rid of the bow. Let's get rid of that imperial sword. Uh, Staff of Fury. Ah, oh, goddammit. So, what else can I buy from you? Do you have anything at all? Anything at all? Come on, bro. Uh, no. But why 800 bucks? I wouldn't pay 800 bucks for that. No. I'm, I'm such a Scrooge. You know what? Fine. I'll buy your wine. How's that? Give me a mead. Give me a wine. Okay, can you buy my stuff now? Yes, okay, thank you. Thank you. Alright, let's get rid of that. And I think I'm mostly done unloading all my crap. Oh, I don't need two of these. Maybe give one to Fondle. Fondle, would you like a Dwarven Shield? Yeah, I think Fondle would like a Dwarven Shield. Be seeing a stranger. And probably shoes. <laughs> He's got shoes, okay. No, I don't care to... I don't care so much... Oh, oh my god, that's... Oh, I accidentally just kicked my poor little kitty in the face. He's hanging out with me. He's keeping me company. I didn't even know he was there. He's so quiet, dude. Oh, gosh, Kinsey. My little dude. Hold on, just one second. I gotta change something, adjust it real quick. Because this hurts. <laughs> Gotta make this happen. There we go. Alright. Ah, uh, no, no I, fu I fucked up again. I brought something up on the other screen. And then I always forget to bring back up OBS when I'm done. So I have to <laughs> do control alt delete twice. Okay, here we go. 
Uh, we're gonna go this away. That doesn't show up my night. Yes, it does. Okay, cool. We're gonna go that way. There are a lot of directions, and this one's mine. Hat's coming off. That's how you know I'm getting serious. Gotta let you shine on. This might be a better night for Minecraft, honestly. I don't know, would any of you care if I switched to Minecraft? I don't know what I would do on Minecraft, actually. I'm just talking. Need it just like collecting stuff. Love seeing those extra little gems. Yeah, you're a good dude, Kenzie. Gotta, gotta spend a little bit of time petting my kitty. Cause he's a good guy. And he just likes he just likes keeping people company. He likes being around. Gonna be able to hop this? No, I don't think I will. No, no, nope, I'm gonna have to go around. Okay. Not sure which way I can go, which way the path is. My instincts are telling me it's the other way, but I'm ignoring those for the moment. Yeah, let me look at the map. Let me look at the map. How am I gonna get around here? Maybe. If I come in around Helgen, I kind of see how it's like, There's looks like there's a little path right here that kind of comes through those two cliffs. There's that extra viewer, finally. It looks like watching myself on my cell phone doesn't give me the extra viewer, but watching myself on the computer does. That's weird. That's a weird detail. I'm gonna save myself pa power by turning that off then. The Twitch app kinda sucks. <laughs> it doesn't offer all the same services that, uh, like, the Twitch app on the computer does. Like, I can't access or adjust my extensions. That's something I have to do all from a computer. And while it's a bit limited, it's like, at least you can watch streams on it. And, like, I think that you can actually, like, uh, cast. Uh, you can stream from your cell phone. Like, of course, it wouldn't be in great quality, but it's like, if you see something that you wanted to share, it's like, you just whip out your phone real quick. Put it up on your channel, and I think that's a good feature. But otherwise, the app itself is kind of limited. Oh. Sorry to hear that about Ganon's stream. What was the spammer doing? Was he just, like, promoting his own channel or something? Or, like, was he saying nasty stuff? Oop, you just had a little premature. I cannot agree more, Mr. Thug. You are going to be so much easier to rob now that you're dead. Oh, yeah, one of those guys. I've had a couple of those show up before. They're annoying, but whatever. Don't really see the value in that, honestly. It's like, sure, you can inflate your numbers just a little bit. 
and, and like you can, it does they, it does give you followers. I know one or two people that's actually like paid to have uh, extra followers to like kickstart their channel, but like that kind of inorganic following, like they're not going to be your viewers. So like you're still going to fall short of the requirements for affiliate, and like or unless you're getting several hundred, it just it's like what's the difference that fifty or so followers is going to make? Fifty inactive followers that don't contribute to your community in any way. Yeah, man. I don't know, I've kind of seen a little bit silly. And for that matter, like, I also think that it's a, a bit of a waste of money to pay for advertising for a channel when you're just starting out. If you really don't have, like, a consistent modus operandi, you don't really have, uh, like, uh, well edited uh, content. Or something catchy or grabby that's going to pull people in and keep them there. Like, I think, like, advertisements that you pay for as a small streamer are just going to get brushed over. Although I could be dead wrong about that because I have no experience with advertisements. Ooh, I'm going to take that. I'm going to take that. Fuck these hunters. <laughs> My collection is more important than your livelihood. Alright. I'm gonna raid this cave, though. Oh, Ancestor Glade. I don't need to be here right now. So, you couldn't sleep, buddy? Oh. Yeah. Paying for viewers, even if, it, like, just lurkers that didn't contribute at all, that would be a different story. But I think it's just some dude that creates a, a bunch of dummy accounts. And uh, then if you pay him money, he'll like your channel. <laughs> really appreciate that, man. Awful thoughtful of you. Yeah, it's been pretty quiet tonight. Been quiet the last couple of nights, honestly. Hey, mind tricks, what up? No, I still don't have command set up. I never give myself enough time to set those up. I'm so sorry, man. Oh yeah, I told Sour Patch that you were streaming. I think he dropped in and said hi. I'm surprised followage works. I didn't set that up either. <laughs> okay, I get it. I get it. I need to, I need to set up commands. I, I need to spend some time on that. I guess that... Nice, dude. I guess the commands really help with the interactive interactive bit of ability interactability of the channel. So it's been pretty lazy of me not to set those up. Oh, it's a big guy. He's a big boy. <laughs> okay. Oh, fire bad. Fire bad. Okay. So that that's a that's what's gonna be the thing now. I don't think Fondle is uh like I think since I'm like walking down this cliffside here that Fondle is like way behind. Oh no, there he is. So I gotta have my follower with me or I'm screwed. So I'm gonna have to find some way to circle around. Like, in a way that'll get Fondle to come with me. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, man. Like, I honestly had no expectations of what your voice sounded like, personally. I, I try not to make assumptions, because I'm always wrong. I'm, I'm a bit of a shitty guesser, with more than math. <laughs> like distance, like fall distance in Skyrim, for example. Not again, not again. Okay, let's see. Uh, do I have fire resistance? Any fire resistance? I really should have bought that potion of fire resistance back at the shop. I looked at that for a second. I was like, that could come in handy at one point. Uh, but no, and here I am. <laughs> Confirmation bias. That's what that is. Oh no, it didn't sound too bad. It didn't actually sound too bad, bro. I think the dragons found Fonda. Okay. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna sleep on that album Warhammer. At least until Fonda gets you. Yeah, I really do. I don't know that my uh, that my audio is bad until you guys tell me. Okay, so he's up there. I guess I, I guess I'm waiting. Yeah, unless it's like Pokemon or something. Yep, gonna need this. Oh, I used it too soon. Oh, he's gonna munch my ass. Ah! Shit! 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 No! Fuck! <laughs> No, man, I got this. I got this. See that dragon? That dragon a bitch. He gonna go down like a bitch. Let's go. Let's go. We're gonna get him. It's just a regular dragon. It's just a regular brown dragon. I got him. And with Fondle here taking the heat, I double got him. I totally got this, bro. You're right. It, it's a foregone conclusion. And for some reason, like, he, he's... He really doesn't like using his bow now that I've given him that axe. So he just... <laughs> Like, Fondle is just my meat shield. I did. I chose to ignore it. <laughs> there we go. Now he's going. Now I think Fondle can be able to help me out. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. You weren't supposed to point at me. You were supposed to go after Fondle. shouting at the dragon. I just imagine when I'm swearing at him, and it makes me feel happier. Oh, <sighs> I still have these from the last encounter. I didn't get a chance to eat them. Oh boy. Oh 
No, I, it, did, it didn't say that you hosted Shinra. Though I appreciate the thought. And I don't think that you can host on a cell phone either. So don't worry about it, buddy. I'm just happy that you're chilling with me. Oh man. Oh, oh no. Oh man. Oh boy. Oh! It, everything is still good. Still got this. Still got this. Yeah, I've been having issues with hosting as well. Like, uh, there's a feature called auto hosting where you can set up a list of streamers that you want your channel to automatically host whenever they're online. And for, like, I have it set for, like, a few of my followers, including you now. But, like, it never seems to actually host. Like, I have to do it manually. Uh, I think it's on streamer tools. The Six Flags theme song. <laughs> that's gotta be a troll answer, you think? I swear, that's gotta be a troll answer. Oh, no! I didn't make the heal in time, bro. If I can just get this dragon low enough to land permanently, I can finish him off, I think. But hold on, I'm gonna see if I can go around. I think he's gonna be more likely to land if I get to his altar. The trick is gonna be, like, getting it so that Fondle is also there. Hey, there you go, mind tricks. That says that you hosted. Appreciate you, man. Uh, you know what? For now, screw this dragon. I'm gonna go around. Really? Just mute the music. I wouldn't have expected that. Uh, I can see how sometimes the music running in some situations kind of like takes you out of the experience. Because it has for me while I'm playing the game. I wouldn't have expected that. Okay, but I believe that this is the Bloodlet Tower, so we're gonna deal with more more vampire stuff. Let's see how much longer I have in this active effect here. Oh, I have. Oh yeah. All right, Chinna. Okay. I think I'm gonna take that potion to cure disease. I know I'm gonna encounter more vampires in there, but I want to have that uh, ex. Like I, I don't want to have that uh, one-handed reduction. I need that. Yeah. Absolutely. <clears throat> oh, and I looked up DMCA, DMCA strikes. And apparently, like, it was happening for streams that had, like, were years old, not just months old. Okay. I got the feeling that I'm totally going to get bodied again. See? That's why I said I'm a shitty guesser. I was wrong. Okay, give me that. And let me see it. Oh, wait, I got the wrong one. Okay. 
Oh, fuck. So we're doing that even though I haven't started Dawnbreaker. I haven't started the Dawnguard quest yet, and we're, we're doing gargoyles. Okay. Yeah, that that's an accurate <laughs> that's an accurate statement about this state of affairs. Oh, why is this gargoyle getting health back so quickly? They have really fast health regeneration. Or I think it's his strikes that actually have absorbed health. Okay. Nice, glad to have you back, Shinra. You're gonna see me get my ass kicked by a bunch of vampires and gargoyles. That's what's on the that's what's on the stream tonight. Ah, oh, Shinra. Like you're one of my oldest and most consistent viewers. Do you want mod? You can say no if you want to. How come that steal? What? What? Who, who am I stealing this from? I'm, I'm really confused. Alright, man. <laughs> Try that YouTube video for uh, for music. I will in a bit. Oh, we're in the back cave. Wow, would you look at that? That's all this guy has to say about anything impressive. <laughs> Thank you, bud. Thank you, buddy. Uh, no, accepting subscribers, that, that, that's a lot of pressure. When people start consistently paying for the service like that... I, I won't... I, I can't be as flaky as I used to be, man. I, I've really got to button up. Thanks, Sour Patch. I really appreciate you guys. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no, no. We're not doing this again. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of vampires. Yeah, get him, Fondle. Oh, boy. That's fine. You don't have to eat it if you don't want to. I'm never gonna ask anybody to subscribe. A follow is one thing. But if you really feel like my content is worth subscribing to, I, I appreciate it, guys, and I accept it. But I always gonna feel uncomfortable asking people to subscribe to the channel. You can't beat me! Like, it, it feels a little odd. Like, upgrading a service to pay for service uh, when it was previously free, you know? There, there's always that level of imposter syndrome that comes with that. Okay. Oh, what's going on with Fondle? That, that's a gargoyle. Oh boy. I think Fondle's dead. Or he's, he's at least knocked out. Oh, big boy's here. Oh, no, no, no. I <laughs> gotcha, Shinra. Yeah. 
I'm not going to be stressing about it at all. Like, the only thing I'm stressing about it is just providing consistent quality content to the people who, who pay for it. In my mind, it's just a lot of responsibility. I guess that's the end, end goal, isn't it? But at the same time... <laughs> it's a little intimidating. Oh, sorry, Bendel. I think I might be better off... If, uh... I, uh, use Heal Other and Fendal here and let him, uh, provide full tank. I haven't set heal other to uh, my uh, act to my quick tab yet, so let's do that. Oh, yep. There we go. That's about the best I can do. Yeah, I suppose that's true. But at the same time, I just feel bad about that. It might be a, it might be a part of the charm, but. Uh, I, I think that's one of the, like, the things that you don't really think about when you're watching cable television, for example. You can always pretend, you can always, like, depend on your favorite show coming on at this time, and, uh, like, it, there's always going to be some kind of progress on your favorite characters, and that there's a... Like, you, you know what I mean? There's, like, a, an ex expectation of consistency that I haven't really been able to provide. <laughs> and I'm, I'm trying to find a groove where I can provide that, but it's been really difficult managing that. My girlfriend's schedule, my debt, my parents' schedule, and uh, like just all of it, you know? And it gets, it, like I say, it's embarrassing a lot, and that's because it is. It gets kind of embarrassing. So I gotta make self-deprecating -de jokes about it to make myself feel better about the situation. It's like I I know, I I, I know that I, I know that it's happening. I'm trying I'm trying not for it to happen that often, and I'm getting better. But I still gotta take the piss out of myself just a little bit. Yeah, I, I guess I'm overthinking it. Really overthinking it. Alright, finally cleared out this dungeon. Took care of the gargoyle, but what am I supposed to be finding here? I guess I keep going that way? Let's see, I got that uh, stamina draining greatsword. So let's disenchant that, get some more carry weight. Got a feeling I'm going to be collecting a couple more vampire tunings along the way. Grab that coin first. I forgot the dude's name. <laughs> Not just like like the vampire's name, but like the quest giver. Like it, it was it was been a while. I got this quest back when I was trying to become a uh, Jarl of Falkreath. And I, like I'm finally strong enough to be able to come over here and take it out. So I th forgot all the details to it. <laughs> Glad you're back, Shinra, but just don't jeopardize you at your school day tomorrow, okay? Don't want you staying up too late to watch me. But if you can't sleep, we'll keep you company, dude. I already have this? Really? Okay. Nice, nice. That, that was a nice dash right there. I think that was Firestorm, too. Dope. Okay. And all of them were like 0.5 carry weight. <laughs> Alright, Sour Patch. It was great having you back on. Like, thanks for giving me that thought. But really, man. Yeah. 
Good night, and I hope you get enough sleep for tomorrow, man. I don't want you driving like that. And for real, dude, like, a lot of these ingredients say steal on them. Like, who am I stealing it from? The vampires? Like, why should I care if I'm stealing it from the vampires or not? If I stole these ingredients in front of the vampires, would I get a bounty in Falkreath? I'm gonna have to try that. Alright, dude. As long as you're comfortable with that, then I'm grateful to have you here, man. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can steal some ingredients in front of these guys and see if that gives me a bounty. That would be bullshit if it does. But, uh... Oh, I'm saving. Oh, this is the boss fight. I'm saving. They're gonna revive these guys. Take ten hour breaks between driving shifts and I only stopped for an hour and a half ago, so I can... <laughs> I got you, dude. Then get a good night's sleep, man. I say dude and man will fight. Hippie, it's showing. Nice out, patch. Gotcha. Then I'll try and kill these guys in that time. Think he's the one I'm after. Vigar. All right. Lazy bastard wouldn't even get off his chair. Oh, well, now he's getting off his chair. Oh, oh, he's strong. Oh, they're strong. Mother. Okay, gotta wait. I'm gonna take care of her first while Kondo handles uh, the guy down there. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah, and you probably have to wake up at like, what? 6? 6 6.30? This is no bad. <laughs> Puppy run. Puppy hub, Taco. Oh, F Fondle, where are you going? Bro! I guess they're not going to attack un un until I open the chain, but, like, that that's kind of distressing. <laughs> oh, dude, that's right. Man, it's going to suck when that's over, huh? Or, I don't know, do you prefer the online classes, or did you, like, did you want to go in person? It's got to be, a, like, convenient on a lot of levels to have online classes. But I can't imagine, like, what that's got to feel like, not being able to go to school and see all your friends. I gotta wait for Final to take care of work. Oh, c c come on. Quit being a bad dog. Let's see, I can put Puppy down with... I-I was, though! I-I am! I-I was! I was! I swear! Did it, did it seriously knock me off? Like, the Twitch app is so inconsistent like that. Like, that's a little trick, mind tricks. Like, you can watch your own stream, and that gets you out of the zero viewers, uh, the zero view, uh, the zero viewers range. Oh. 
Oh no. Fondle's not here. I'm gonna get pushed in. Oh, and there was another dog. I'm so dead. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> the level up sound just rubbing in. No, like that's the odd thing. I was watching it on my cell phone and it didn't affect my average viewers. Like when I was watching my channel on my cell phone, it didn't count towards my active viewers. And it only counted when I activated it on uh, my computer. Dude. And this dog keeps running away and he keeps luring away Fondle. Oof. Quit running, you. Where the hell are you going, puppy? Dude, I'm just gonna have to follow Fendal this time. I'm gonna have to take out this dog with him. And then I'll just have to walk the whole way back. Yeah, I don't know, it might have something to do with the fact that it's me watching it. Like, here, I'll pause the game and I'll watch myself right now on my phone and we'll see if the viewers go up. Okay, so it's gone, it's loading. You can see, like, that's me. That's me. I'm on there, I'm just chilling. Yeah, I could do that, too. If I really wanted to, I could just make three of them. Get that affiliate right away. Did it? Did it, did it, did it really? Oh. That's... <laughs> I'm not gonna complain. A little frustrated. Might have been a bit... Not gonna complain. Let's take out these damn vampires. <laughs> Get him, Fondle. Finally tearing you. Oh, yeah, it's working now. I couldn't get it to work earlier like that. That is so unusual. Oh, what's up, Kinsey? My cat saying that he's hungry. What? He used Ray's dead on the vampire. Where are you going? And Fondle's gonna get the execution on this guy now. Yep. Oh, I got it first. Ha! Ah! Yeah, it's working. That's all I care about. <laughs> oh, I got it working just in time. Oh, no. I think I have that. Let's see. Yep. Sanguinary Vampires again. I knew it the moment I saw my lower total health. I already used my cure disease potion at the beginning of this cave. Yeah, I already have my phone at a low at a low light setting. Just don't I, I just don't have high light settings for my uh, phone or my computers in general. It really messes with my eyes, you know. I'm just gonna take uh, the strength potion for this one. <laughs> night for the, uh, what's it this time? This is like, uh, third night night? This is the third night night. Well, actually, guys, I'm thinking I'm gonna be calling it. I know I'm scheduled for three hours, but, like, <laughs> Yeah, I, I I think that's it for me too. Be careful. 
I got done a lot already. And, uh, yeah, like, with, with you guys going to sleep, like, I don't really have anyone else to hang with, you know? There might be somebody that hops on. But I haven't gotten a lot of new viewers uh, through Skyrim. It's mostly been through Minecraft. I'm not going to get a lot of outreach tonight. Oh, and I'm back here. This is just a good time to call it anyway. I'll find my way out next time. Uh. Oh, Shinra, Sour Patch. Let's call it here. Had a good time playing with you guys tonight. Tomorrow it's going to be Minecraft. 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Yep. Yeah, that's another thought I was having about that. <clears throat> oh, boy. Yeah, but at least for tomorrow, I think Minecraft is going to be 8 p.m. to 11 p.m. Uh, I think uh, I haven't told you yet, Mind Tricks, but I'm considering uh, streaming earlier. Probably going to start uh, streaming 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. I'm going to see how that works out with my schedule. But, and uh, the days I stream are going to change. It's going to be Monday, Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday. And uh, I might do an early afternoon streaming on Tuesday and Thursday, but that's only if I have time, so I wouldn't count on it. Yeah, and that's one of the things I have. It's like... <laughs> that's one of my regrets, too, is that no matter what my schedule it is, it conflicts with Ganon's a little bit. But that also is a good thing, too, because it'll make it easier for us to be able to collaborate later on. I'm looking forward to having him on Among Us with us on another one of our gaming nights. Yeah, like, last Saturday was his fiance's birthday, so I can understand why he wouldn't want to, uh, like, uh, he, he wouldn't want to stay on too late and hang with us, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, I'm, I'm thinking... What the hell was I thinking? I just drew a total blank. It's like... The hamster wheel suddenly stopped spinning and the hamster inside it died. That's that's the feeling I just got. <laughs> yeah. Like we can install a multiplayer mod and add it on to our vanilla runs. And start it as a separate save file. I know that I'm planning on using this character as like a jeez, I'm just going around in circles, aren't I? I do too. That'd be so fun if we could all just squad up and play Skyrim together. Using our end level characters, I try Burma or something like that. That'd be so much fun, dude. How the fuck do I get out of this cave? <laughs> Soon. Sude. Sude. But yeah. I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to the day when I can throw a bunch of mods on this character and come back and revisit him. And multiplayer is going to be one of the first ones on the list. I finally found my way out of this goddamn cave, yes! <laughs> I'm surprised there wasn't an exit to this place. Yeah! Instead of having followers, we just go in and beat the shit out of the... <laughs> and I'm back at the start. A absolutely, man. This plow through Bleak Falls Barrow at the beginning on Legendary, just gang beat the, the Draugr Death Lord. Like, I imagine, like, going through Bleak Falls Barrel with a bunch of fresh characters would be a lot like Shaun of the Dead. Like, that scene where they're circling around a zombie's bank, like, beating them with sticks. <laughs> yeah. Pack of werewolves and we're all summoning ghost werewolves. Like, dude, I'm so lost in this cave that my potion of strength wore out. Oh my god. Okay, Fondle, come here a second. Still here. What do you want me to care? How the fuck do I get out of this cave? I'm so lost. Here, you can you can have it, stupid. Fine. Wear it. Wear it. I don't care. Just hold on to my stuff. I don't have it. Indeed, I'll follow. Like, here's the quest marker, right? 
Okay, so the door is over there. I haven't been even been looking at the quest marker, man. I've just been trying to, like, go by memory here. Alright, so... Like, this is the exit, right? Go through here. This door was locked. This door was barred before. So I, I think I have to go up the stairs here. I came up through the stairs. Yes, okay. I finally made it out. I made it out of the cave. Yes. Oh, bro. I know. I know it, dude. It's like, the will is there, but the critical thought process is just not as... Yeah, I gotta work on that a bit. <laughs> Let's go to Pine Watch. Because I think... No! Okay. Okay, it's not quite there yet. I should, yeah, but first... I gotta go and use the Shrine of Talos. It just occurred to me that I have Sanguinary and Vampires. I thought for a second that I had fully transformed. I don't want to forget about that. And then halfway through my stream tomorrow, like, have that fully set in. Yeah, man. Do you get Vampire Lord abilities if, uh, if you become a vampire through, uh, Drain Health? Or do you just become a regular jack-off vampire? Yeah, that's what I thought. If I'm gonna become a vampire, I wanna become a badass vampire that can transform and have claws and shit. I don't wanna be one of those regular jack-offs. Mm -mm. I'm actually gonna end it here, though. Because I'm gonna to wanna to sell all my loot and disenchant before I go to store everything in the, uh, uh, the next time I come in. Oh. Yeah, it really does. But this is a 100% run, you have to remember. So, Vampire Lord is on the bucket list. I have to become a Vampire Lord. And, uh... Oh, I have to get all the perks for it. So, I'm thinking I'm gonna save that for the Civil War quest, because there are so many different, like, uh, guards and enemies that you can drain. Like, they don't actually aggro you. If you transform into a werewolf or a Vampire Lord while you're in the Civil War quest line, like, whatever side you're allied with will actually not attack you. They'll be non-aggressive. But that is it for today. Controller's down. Yeah, that's a way that I get a few uh, uh, perk levels with that real quick. But yeah, night, Sour Patch. Uh, night, everybody who checked in. This has been Dr. Greenstone. It's been another great stream. I'll be back to you guys tomorrow at 8 p.m. This time, Minecraft for real. Won't be a typo this time. But until then, get some good night's sleep. Peace out, guys.